Animal welfare activists have renewed their campaign to have jumps racing outlawed after a fatal accident during a steeplechase event at the annual Easter races at Oakbank in South Australia. Anti-jumps campaigners are demanding a cruelty investigation into the death of a second horse at the Oakbank Easter Carnival. Racing officials are under attack after the belated discovery that a second horse died in jumps racing at Oakbank. What do you think the highlight of um, today will be? Oh, getting through our jumps races with no horses tipping over. Before Oakbank 2012, we've seen the deaths of 24 horses since 1984 at Oakbank. This year, we saw another two. We saw Vivacity fall and be killed in the Von Dusa steeplechase, the very race that he had championed only years earlier. On the second day of racing, we saw the running of the Great Eastern Steeplechase. During this race, we saw Thomond Park fall violently and narrowly escape death. Two other horses were also retired during the Great Eastern Steeplechase. Art Success suffered a fractured pelvis, was walked off the course and killed where no one could see. And as a result, the RSPCA have launched an investigation into the death of Art Success. The Animal Welfare Act of South Australia clearly states that any person who intentionally, unreasonably or recklessly causes an animal unnecessary harm is guilty of an offence. Nothing could be more reckless than jump racing. There's no denying, Oakbank 2012 was a disaster, not just for the racehorses, but for the reputation of the carnival. We've got the public hating on jumps racing, the media questioning why it still continues, and the RSPCA launching an investigation. We're planning to make Oakbank 2012 the last Oakbank that features jumps racing. So here's the plan. We know that the sponsors of Oakbank have enormous influence over the running of the club and the carnival. We believe that the sponsors won't want to be associated with the cruel sport of jumps racing and the negative publicity that comes with it. So we're contacting them and asking them to withdraw their sponsorship until Oakbank gets rid of jumps racing. We believe the carnival can flourish without jumps racing and people can come along without having to worry about witnessing the public executions of race horses. So this is where you come into it. This campaign relies on you, your support, your dedication and your commitment. We need you to go to our website. All of the sponsors are listed there. Let them know how you feel. Tell them you want them to pull their support of jumps racing. We believe that they actually feel the same way, but until they voice their opposition to it, then we have to assume they support it. Phone, email, snail mail, Facebook, Twitter, whatever you gotta do, let them know that you don't support it and you want them to withdraw their support of jumps racing. Share this video, tell your friends. Together, we can do this. We can't let up and we must make sure that Oakbank 2013 doesn't have jumps racing.